What is up everybody, it's Larry back with you. Today we're going to talk about a couple different microphone sets uh, for different use case scenarios. So we'll talk about those in a moment, but these are from CK Mova. That's what I'm going to say, CK Mova. And this one right here, the larger box, is the UM100 kit number three. So what this is, an ultra compact UHF dual channel wireless microphone. But the kicker here is the connection point, the receiver, is a USB type C like dongle. So this should be able to plug into your phone. Like what I have here, what I'm gonna try it on is my iPad Pro and my Note 20 uh, Ultra. So we will try that with this. So that's what the UM100 is. Then you have the Loom 2. And this is a very simple, uh, simple microphone, and it's USB Type A, so you can plug it directly into your computer. So nowadays, with a lot of people working from home, I do a lot of Teams calls, which is Microsoft, um, like Zoom. But I do a lot of calls, and a lot of people have very bad microphones or very bad headsets, and think they have good microphones, but they're really bad. Something like this is very simple, inexpensive. From what I can tell, the conversion, it's about $28. I've asked them to send me pricing, so if I have that by the time the video goes live, it'll be down in the description, uh, or I'll put it up on the screen if I get it in time. But again, this is just USB type A, plugs in, put the lavalier mic you know, this far away from your mouth. This is like the standard that and then it's a two millimeter uh, two millimeter it's a two meter cable um so yeah so let's unbox the loom 2 first faux leather carrying case that's it for that and then the microphone i mean pretty straightforward so it's a larger mic capsule but you get the nice alligator clip clip it onto your shirt clip is tight so you gotta work that one work it out but I mean and then it's just USB type A to plug right in at the very end of this video I'll do an example so when I say goodbye we'll come back and then I'll just give you a little example of this and as well as the UM100 but I mean this is pretty straightforward plugs into your USB type A this will work for Windows or Mac so we will try that out and see let's get into this one a little bit more involved nice hard case got a little handle on it let's see what we got in here okay so we got a little pocket over here we got some instructions should be pretty straightforward here is your transmitter pack you got a little metal belt clip on the back your antenna is nice and flexible, so that's nice. Micro USB charging, you know I'm not a fan of that, but it is what it is. Then here is your USB type C like dongle receiver. So here you got a power, your signal, and then AF. All of them have, looks like they have LED indicators. Another lavalier microphone that's gonna plug into the top of the transmitter. You have an extra windscreen, so that's nice. Obviously this is a 3.5 millimeter. It's gonna plug into the top of your receiver. Very small and compact. Take that off. You got a set button here, charge micro USB on the side. Looks like a charging indicator next to that. Button here, and then you have your on and off. Oh, no, this is power here and then LCF on and off. Let's take a look at this. It's actually got a display. Can't really tell, but there's an LED display. Let's see if there's any juice. So you got your battery, what channel you're on, your signal strength, and then what you can change your channel to make sure you got a good frequency. This is a noise reduction switch over here environmental noise reduction switch and when you put it on you're going to get noise reduction i don't know if there's a lot of setup needed or what but let's just pop this in we got power signal guessing we're connected audio device connected 
You plug in an electric guitar or microphone in order to hear yourself while you play. Turn on auto monitor. Turn on monitoring if using a microphone wearing headphones recommended to avoid feedback. Well, you can see I'm already, I mean, this was so painless to set up. It's almost ridiculous. So if you're using something like GarageBand, you have all these other um, compressor and things that you can do. But let's do, do narrator. And let's record a little bit. What is up everybody, it's Larry back with you and today we're checking out the UM100 Kit 3. This is the USB Type-C receiver that you can plug into your iPad. And we're recording on it right now in GarageBand using Narrator and we got a little compression going on. Um, but yeah, what do you guys think about this audio quality? What is up everybody, it's Larry back with you and today we're checking out the UM100 Kit 3. <laughs> this is the USB... That sounds really good. Like I said, you guys, you'll be seeing this at the end or whatever. I'll, I'll, I'll put this actual audio file at the end of this video. So another thing I wanted to check real fast though, is this. So one of the features in the Note 20 Ultra is if you go into camera and you go to pro video, you can select an external device for your audio. So let's see how this... So here we see in the settings there's a USB. Records through a USB mic or headset. So now we're picking up... As you can see the levels there. So let's see what we got here. What is up everybody? It's Larry back with you. What is up everybody? Check. So it's hard to see there's no peaking. It looks like I'm going, it looks like I should be peaking but there's no red. So, uh, okay, well, we're pretty far away because I'm afraid I'm peaking but what is up everybody? It's Larry back with you. Today we're checking out the UM100 Kit 3. This is a USB Type-C receiving wireless microphone kit that you can use on your Galaxy, on your Samsung Galaxy Note Ultra 5G or your iPad Pro. Really anything with a USB Type-C port. Technically, I guess you could use this on a MacBook Pro, but I think it's an awesome option for mobile recording. So it's hard to see, there's no peaking. It looks like I'm going, it looks like I should be peaking, but there's no red, so. Uh, okay, we're pretty... It sounds really good. Like I said, you'll see, I'll put the whole clip at the end of the video. If you guys are interested in seeing maybe doing a vlog style video or maybe a podcast style video, something where I'm recording all my audio, all my audio in the iPad Pro, or maybe a vlog using the Note 20 Ultra, let me know if you guys want to get more of an, you know, with me outside, me walking around, give you more of a real world feel. Let me know in the comments section below, but... That's going to be it for this one. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Big shout out to CK Mova, Sikmova for sending out these. Um, I think these are going to be fantastic. Again, make sure you stay to the end of the video. We're going to take a look at the um, UM100 Kit 3. I'll put the audio files from the Note 20 Ultra and the iPad Pro after the end of the video. And uh, also I'll put a sample of the Loom 2, the LUM2 as well after this video. So that's gonna be it. If you guys enjoyed this, hit the thumbs up. If you've yet to subscribe, you can do that down below. Uh, hit that notification bell so you don't miss when we upload. And that's gonna be it. I appreciate you guys watching and I will talk to you in the next one. What is up everybody, it's Larry back with you and today we're checking out the UM100 Kit 3. This is the USB Type-C receiver that you can plug into your iPad and we're recording on it right now in GarageBand using Narrator and we got a little compression going on um, but yeah what do you guys think about this audio quality what is up everybody it's Larry back with you today we're checking out the UM100 Kit 3 this is a USB Type-C receiving wireless microphone kit that you can use on your Galaxy on your Samsung Galaxy Note Ultra 5G or your iPad Pro. Really anything with a USB Type-C port. Technically, I guess you could use this on a MacBook Pro, but I think it's an awesome option for mobile recording. 
What is up everybody, Larry back with you. Today we're talking about the Loom 2. This is the microphone that just plugs into your USB type A and then just start recording with a lavalier, lavalier mic. Now I have this plugged into my iMac. Uh, this is an older iMac, so I have USB type A. And then it's just plugged in and then recording through GarageBand. No real EQ or compressor put on it. So let me know what you guys think. This will work on your iMac, your PC, really anything with a USB type A that can accept a microphone input. Let me know what you guys think down in the comment section below.